U.S. stocks, they were in positive territory Tuesday afternoon. This with the Dow Jones hitting another new intraday record high and the S&P 500 closing in on its all-time high levels. Now, first on the U.S. economic front factory orders, they climbed 3%. Moving over to Europe, markets Eurozone manufacturing PMI index for the month of March that came in at a reading of 46.8, a reading that topped an earlier estimate of 46.6. And with European shares today rallying on eased Cyprus concerns, oil down by more than a quarter of 1%, and the euro trading steady against the U.S. dollar. The Dow Jones Industrial Average managed to hit a fresh intraday high of 14,684.49. And looking at where it stands right now after the closing bell, the Dow Jones Industrial Average is on the upside, 89.16 points to settle in at 14,662.01. Now on to today's movers and shakers. We first begin with shares of NASDAQ, which took a hit. This after the stock exchange announced that it will acquire eSpeed for trading U.S. Treasuries in the secondary market from BCG Partnerson, a deal worth roughly $1.23 billion. Meanwhile, BCG, that surged more than 40 percent. Ford shares today climbing after the automaker posted March sales that gained 5.7 percent, topping estimates calling for a 3.8 percent rise. And over in the tech sector, Hewlett Packard tumbled to lead the Dow laggards. This after Goldman Sachs cut its rating on the tech company to sell from neutral, saying that sentiment about the company has moved ahead of the reality of the company. 